How can I improve my accuracy when I'm stuck between two answers 50 50 and avoid picking out a familiarity or tunnel vision? I've inculcated that when you don't know an answer, don't choose weird sounding shit. Okay. And when you pick an answer and you don't know an answer, don't change your answer. Okay. Sometimes the answer really is just cryptosporidium parvum, not isospora belly. Okay. Sometimes the answer really is just ITP, not pseudo gray platelet syndrome. So don't choose weird answers. And if you're reading an answer or reading a question and you choose sickle cell, you're like, sounds like sickle cell, sounds like sickle cell, sounds like sickle cell. Then you see the answers and you're like, ooh, thalassemia, wrong fucking answer. Okay. It's sickle cell. So don't change your answer when you don't know the answer. Don't choose weird sounding shit. I see this all the time. Like students I have on Zoom, when they're hovering on a question, it's like a simulation thing. I can predict it. Like choice D will be something really fucking weird. And I'm like, they're going to choose D because they don't know the answer. And they choose D. I'm like, have you ever heard of that before? And they're like, no. I'm like, why the fuck did you choose it?